Good day and welcome again to Festival. My name is Wayne Robinson, editor of Print21. Right now I'm on the booth of Roland DG. I'm with Anders Muskoff, Mark Artigas from Roland DG. Uh, we're at Festival. Anders, perhaps I can start with you. What's the main message that Roland DG, major supplier, manufacturer of wide format print equipment, what's the main message you're giving to the market here? We are giving a very positive message. We can see that the market is growing here for us. We are introducing new products here and, and the new flagship, which we have the, the uh, new Truvis 3, okay. DG 3640. Okay. And there's a bunch of other products here as well. But I can also tell you that we are so happy about the interest that we have seen here. And it have been really busy days. Okay, and why are people interested, particularly in this TrueViz VG3640? This is a new machine for you guys? It's a new machine here. So, and Mark will uh, talk about the details here. Okay. Mark, just look at the camera. Isn't it? Yeah, this is the, the new flagship machine from Roland, the new print and cut model, TrueViz 3. We have it in uh, 64 inches as well as 54 inches. Okay. And the new uh, features between this model and the previous one is that we have a uh, seven inches touch panel also the take-up is included and we have a wide range of colors including orange okay. green lights and white okay. so it's a perfect solution for a sun maker okay yeah so it's more more colors easier automation or more automation is that how you describe it yeah we also introduce uh, auto calibration mode so for the end user it's very easy to just load the media and the machine calibrates itself so it helps the end user to make its life uh, much uh, easier. Because I guess all around the world, and certainly in Australia and New Zealand, labor is an issue, lack of staff is an issue, so your response is to automate the machines more. Yeah, the idea is to make uh, the machine more uh, self-attendance. Yeah. Also, we are introducing Roland DigiConnect, which is a software that can uh, connect the machine and give to the end user all the information about the uh, running cost, if they are having an issue with the ink, some uh, ink is running out. So, I mean, in that sense, the machine can just print an attendant. Okay, so yeah, data collection yeah. is really yeah. key, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, and, and there's, what else have you got on the booth? We can't walk around and see it, but uh, what, what's We have plenty of machines here. We also have flatbed machines, UV flatbed machines. Okay. Of course, also smaller flatbed machines are also big sizes. Yeah. We also carry on one is, which is called the IU1000F which is a large printer. Yeah. And of course, I hope that you will be able to take some pictures of it afterwards yeah. so you can show it as well. I will, yeah. So you've got the display graphics range, but then also promotional products. That's what you're talking about with the smaller machines, isn't it? Definitely, yeah. Well, we also have, you know, the smaller flatbeds up there, but which you also have to go and see, which is the S machines, okay. which is also where you can put in a lot of different materials, also with a certain height. Yeah. You can also see here that we have put in light switches which you can print on and the way that the printer is printing makes it easier for people to make a very good print on these kind of, uh, of substrates. Okay, and are these machines for print service providers that are possibly looking for additional revenue streams from just printing posters? Exactly, but, but uh, back into that point here. Yeah, it's what Anders was explaining. We have also our LEF machines, which are perfect if you want to diversify your business to print on GIFs, uh, promotional items and also we are introducing a new rotary system so you can print uh, bottles, cans, whatever with this cylinder. Okay, fantastic. Well listen guys, thanks so much for spending time Thank to you. talk to people in Australia and New Zealand. For everyone that is uh, back, at, back home, uh, Roland DG of course will be one of the main exhibitors at Pack Print next month or actually the end of this month and uh, most of the equipment that these guys are talking about will be on show there. That's it for this uh, episode of uh, FESPA from uh, Print21. Thanks to you guys and uh, goodbye for now.